hi guys it's morning so i want to quickly run to the store it's my shopping day to buy um groceries for my family this video is like a continuation of the last video that i uploaded which was about you know what you're putting in your body this is like the second video or like the intro to the video i recorded like three weeks ago so like i said in my last video you don't need to you know have a whole lot of money to start switching to organic because you're doing it with the future in mind so let's get into the video today i'm not really hungry because it's pretty early so on that day i you know i started the day with a bowl of cereal because i was really hungry i don't really like taking cereal but you know that day like i said i was hungry and because i don't really take cereal if i want to take cereal i use organic cereals organic cereal and organic milk so start switching to organic little by little because it pays in the long run so let's get in the video hi guys so this is the first store i'll be visiting i do three shoppings so i'll go to haldi i'll go to kroger and i'll go to walmart so let's go shopping yeah this is aldi store welcome first of all the surprising thing that you see in any store is that the regular food will be you know will take over a whole lot of space and the organic will be in this corner you know where i'll pick some fruit the grapes and probably the blueberries uh, in this store they did not have strawberries so I had to go to Walmart to get my strawberries. The whole purpose of this video is to help you to, you know, select your food. You don't have to eat anything or buy anything. You have to make sure it's healthy. So I'm picking up banana, organic bananas and organic peppers. On to the eggs now. I'm just checking it if it's you know not cracked and everything is good, but it has to be organic eggs. Now on to the milk. One interesting thing I can say about the milk is that when I was drinking regular milk, it used to bother me. But now that I'm drinking organic, I feel so good. You know, I can testify that organic foods are good food. Hi guys, I'm done with the Aldi going to another store right now. See you. Yeah, we are at Kruger now. So once again, oh. let's go shopping. About to pick my bacon. I normally go with Simple Truth. Simple Truth is an organic company that make organic produce, organic foods. So after that, I went to pick my hot dogs. So, there are some check marks that I normally look for in my hot dog. No filters, gluten-free, carcinogen-free, fully cooked. No antibiotics ever. So, my kids are safe. I also pick up my tin tomatoes, if you can see non-GMO on it for my pizza i use it to make pizza and also to cook jello rice <laughs> and here are the organic portion of kroger store you know my cucumber um my green pepper and a whole lot of stuff like the kales it has to be organic all this portion is for organic so everything here organic you know pick up my carrots yeah this is how I shop now on to picking apples my kids love apples and it's good for snack they snack with it very often and I pick organic apples all right I'm trying to get some ice cream the weather is hot this is vanilla non-gmo that is what I'm gonna go with So, 
look at this look at the price so look at the price for this one $5.99 and if it's on sale it's $3.49 let me show you another one a big bowl you know inorganic very big it's almost the same price see all right guys i'm walking out of Kroger right now this my girl is sleeping so i'll be going to walmart i'll tell you the reason why i go to three stores in a short while see you soon okay guys we're leaning at walmart so guys i'm at walmart right now let's go shopping at walmart i am checking for the usd organic in the mandarin but i couldn't find it so i didn't buy it and i went and pick up organic strawberries and also organic green beans yes i don't see that in other stores also pick up organic broccolis now on to the snack i normally go for snacks that are less sugary i talked about sugar in my last video if you look at this one it has zero grams of sugar zero and when you look at the other one it's just two grams two percent of sugar see in fact one gram total sugar one gram yeah i'm bagging right now almost done i am finally done i'm finally done Yay! Goodbye to Walmart. Oh, what a day! So guys, the purpose why I do three, you know, stores at the same time is because there are some things, there are some organic things that are sold in Walmart that you can't find in Kroger or Aldi. So, like I said, healthy parenting is also healthy food. So, what your family put in their body matters. And if you are in charge of groceries it is your responsibility to make the right choice so i might be stressed out i might be tired but i'm happy that what my family is putting in their body is 100 percent healthy so let's go home <laughs> so guys i'm through i'm tired good thing i didn't take a shower ready to go for a shower so yeah the groceries they I have some cleaning to do the apples the strawberries the carrots the cucumber the, the blueberries they're gonna be clean before going into the refrigerator so I'm about to clean my fruit and vegetables I am putting in clean water not tap water clean water then putting the fruits then i now put in apple cider vinegar it helps to clean out any excess dirt or chemical then i'm cleaning all the fruit however watermelon pineapple oranges and mangoes are not organic because I can't find them in the store. With time, I might be ordering some foods that I can't find in the store. But for now, you know, we are on a budget. So this is what I can get. So my people, I'm back from this edition of shopping. You know, it's um this is the second 
one I'm videoing. Oh. At first, I thought I'm gonna do a quick shopping, you know, go to just one shop, but I ended up going to three shops again. You know, I was looking for blueberries because one of my boys love berries. I mean, blueberries and strawberries. He doesn't eat any other fruit apart from those two. So those two fruits, I like getting them every time I shop. So I went to Aldi. You've seen Aldi in my first shopping video. I went to Aldi to, to get blueberry. And I also, you know, there was no okra in the first shop. So I had to go to Walmart to get okra. But unfortunately, I couldn't find okra. I used okra to make soup. So I did a video on, you know, how I make okra soup cooking with my kids. And some of my American friends were like, really? Okra soup? Ew, that's going to be slimy. And I'm like, well, you've not tried it before. I was also like, well, when I came to the U.S. and I saw fried okra was like, really? Fried okra? And also, you know, pickled okra. So try my own method. You're going to like it. So today I didn't really buy lots of fruits because I still have some things in my refrigerator. So, and also sometimes, you know, to cut down on expenses, I have to, you know, alternate. If I buy this one this week, next week I buy another one. So the USDA organic that I was talking about, let me, let me show you. It's like, you know, USDA organic. So this blueberry doesn't have pesticide poured on it you know glyphosate that i talked about so i have peace of mind when i give this to my family to my kids and that's what my boy eats so if he eats only berries i only get organic berries for him good thing i normally shop in the morning so that when i come back i refresh and relax so thank you so much for watching i hope i am able to share what was shared to me some years back that convinced me to go for organic foods. Healthy Parenting is a holistic channel that talks about raising healthy and happy kids and also healthy foods and healthy living in general. So if that sounds like something that you're interested in, go ahead and click on the subscribe button and turn on your notification so that you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you next time. Bye-bye.